All right, here's the ZTEC MIS-21B. You can see it's not hooked up to power. That's a probe cable. It's got a new battery pack in it. Actually, there's two packs. <coughs> right now, it's just set up to conductivity. This probe comes with it, surface conductivity probe. I just have it calibrated, ferrite to go up, stainless, copper, nickel, magnesium, 70, 75, T6. Oh, let me do that again. I wasn't holding the probe flush. Beautiful. All right, there's conductivity curve. Before I do the crack sample, I'll show the cables. <clears throat> These are four pin connectors. And you have an adapter to run four pin um, <clears throat> adapter cables. There's two different sizes with the four pins here. One is for small cigar probes, and this one, this is for the small cigar probes, four pin. This one's for the larger cigar probes, four pin. So that's what you got, one, two, three, four. And then you get this adapter. So that's five cables. <clears throat> this end goes to the tester. And then this end, this is a ZTEC cable. So you got three pins in there. I think there's three in there, if you can see them. But that's where the ZTEC probes will attach. I think I have one laying here somewhere. Maybe not. I guess I have to go get it. <coughs> There's one. So I'm going to take this probe out. Clear. And in this cable, there's a little <clears throat> there's a little notch in there, so you can only put the probe in one way. Push it in. i got to make sure that we attach the probe with the red dot towards the front, which is right like so. All right, let's see how we can calibrate this. I got a EDM notch block, aluminum. Hopefully my probe is good. Balance, this will be, this is where we got to figure out what we got going on here. So let me go down, I'm gonna go higher frequency. We'll go to like 300 kilohertz. 300, here we're getting closer. Okay, this 300 kilohertz, still no signal. So what does that mean? Nothing. Just means we're not done with our setup yet. Okay, I need to increase my gain just a tad. Actually, I'm going to put my probe drive up a little bit. Oh, we're going to go down to there. Balance, that's 4 volts. And I'm going to crank my gain up a tad. Going a little bit higher with the gain. Maybe I have to do some impedance matching here. Let me see. Single. Phase, position. Uh, screen, no. Yeah, I just gotta go with uh, a little bit higher voltage. Then I'm going to change the position of my null point, which is going to be this way. Sorry. 
hand to go down to the bottom. Look at that sketch. Now we need to go and crank our gain up a little bit. signal so what that means is that probably got the wrong config maybe it's like probe type there we go driver pickup is it a driver pickup I doubt it <laughs> oh, I guess it is no wonder I wasn't getting a signal before You gotta play around with it till you figure it out. Okay, so now I can bring my gain down a tad because I'm really hot. All right, now we're getting close. Now I gotta get the phase. Ooh, beautiful. How do you like that? Mm, I'm going to bring the phase down. Just a tad. There's our lift off line. Beautiful. Okay, now we can bring the gain up now that we got our phase selected. Bring our gain up by six. And you got to rebalance every time. Well, let's go up one more time here. Going up a little bit more with the gain. And balance, there we go. And if you want to get fancy, you can go crank in some more um, vertical gain to get more vertical amplitude in your signal but here's a 40 mil crack 40 mil deep there's a 20 mil deep and that's the 10 mil deep right there so there you go you've seen conductivity curves and some crack responses oh that's your battery charger there too so the only probe that you'll get with this one is conductivity probe which is where where's the conductivity probe oh right here yeah you'll get that probe all right i hope you enjoyed the video